Hi, Linda Bowen here from StampingWithLinda.com, your cardiologist since 1997, helping you create cards from the heart. Today is Friday, so tips and techniques, and today I'm going to share a fun technique that I learned on Demonstrator Planning Place. That is a place where demonstrators go um, and inspire each other with different um, techniques. And this technique was shared and I just loved it. It's called four corner stamping and it is a quick way to make multiple cards in a very short period of time. Now I have a piece of very vanilla um, cardstock. This measures eight inches by 10 and a half and I am going to score at the four inch mark and the five and a quarter. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly make four cards um, with background um, stamping. No, no layers. You could use layers for this technique. I am choosing not to. I want to just show you how quick we can make four cards. So first what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my soft seedling um, stamp set. I'm going to ink it in my granny apple green. I'm going to go in with my blending brush and grab some Cajun craze and I'm just going to add that to my stamp. Now I've got my score lines and so I am going to be stamping right on those score lines and each time I stamp, now I'm just going to stamp off to get that color off. I'm going to go in with the green and add the Cajun craze with my blending brush. I'm going to add that. Now we could do this for um, our Christmas cards. This would make a very quick way to make multiple cards. Um, I'm thinking the Leaves of Holly um, stamp set would be a good one for this. We could just make it in a monochromatic card if we wanted. So what I'm doing is I'm just following down the um, score lines with that stamp set. And let's go ahead and get another one over here. Now if you don't have the blending um, brushes, you could always use um, daubers. Stamp off again. I'm going to do one more. Here. But then I want to grab the four corners and I think I'm going to go with just straight Cajun craze. Let's go ahead and like I said, this is a great technique to use when you want multiple cards made in a very quick way. Now I could use die cuts and do a little more embellishment in the center, but I'm going to make these cards very simple. I'm using my go-to greetings and I'm going to stamp the thinking of you. Thinking of you of course can be used for anything. Birthday, someone that's not feeling well. And so I'm just stamping that greeting between the leaves. Next what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring back that trimmer and I'm going to cut. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of those ink pads because I know me. I'm constantly putting my cardstock in my ink. So we're going to use our cutter this time and we are going to cut along those score lines. So at the four inch and then at the five and a quarter.
like so. I've already cut four pieces of the Cajun Craze. These measure four and an eighth by five and three eighths. I'm going to bring in two pieces of eight and a half by eleven um, cardstock, and I am going to score them at four and a quarter inch. and then cut them at the five and a half so it gives me four A2 card bases. So put that back in like so. And now I'm ready to assemble my cards. So go ahead and score that over. Add my stamp and seal. Like I said, need a lot of thank you cards after the holidays or Christmas cards, upcoming birthday cards. This is a quick way to get a lot of cards in a very short span of time. And we can dress them up as much as we want. Again, I'm just going for a very quick look, no layering. Remember in the day we never did layer our cards. We, unless we had a mistake we were covering up, um, cards were kind of flat and looking. And that's okay. Simple stamping is perfectly fine. Now we're ready to add those card fronts. And in a matter of minutes, we are going to have four cards done. So this one... And even though they're the same, because we randomly stamped on the four corners, they each look just a little bit different. So we'll look at all of them when we get done here. And now this one we're going to put this way because of the way I stamped the greeting. But there you have four Thinking of You cards done in a matter of minutes. Hope you've enjoyed this technique, and we'll talk to you real soon. Bye-bye.